on an adventure of a lifetime. Bro, we're gonna crash! Oh. So come see the movie of the year. I love you, bro. Jimmy's a good kid, first year on the force. He jokes around from time to time, but he gets down to business when things get real. Hey! Jesus. What's with the camera? Uh, uh, we're a TV crew, and we're filming for our show, People of the Neighborhood. And, uh, what exactly is this show about? Well, we travel to different cities and towns and find interesting people to do stories on. Ah, I thought you were a secret government agency hell-bent on getting my formulas. Um, no. Well, in that case, you should do a story on me. After 2 p.m., I like to retire to the Oak Grove and yell at the squirrels. Let me show you how I do my work. We got one over here, don't scare it. South Pole, do you think this is? Hello. Welcome to the United Corporation of Assassins for Hire, also known as Yuka. We are the best corporation of Assassins for Hire in America. we will now introduce this evening's races. In lane one, on your knees. And in lane three, Lube. And they're off. Uh, I used to love my wife. Then I realized how crazy she was and realized the relationship wasn't for me. Technically, I can't divorce her because then she'd take all my money and I wouldn't get to see my kid even if he is 20 years old. So what I decided to do was to take my relationship into a different direction. Alyssa, she's my assistant. I mean, she's really intelligent, you know? A lot going on up here. I love her, I guess you could say, but like a boss loves his assistant. Where is your boss? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I think you do know what I'm talking about. Where is your boss? I'm not telling you anything. No, I'm done playing games here. Hey, can you help me real quick? Okay, okay. Uh, all right, all right, all right, on three, okay? Right. All right. One, two, three. You're gonna talk now? Oh no, if we don't get that antidote for the zombie virus soon, John is going to die. Uh, that would be really bad. Hey, you know, when I went to bed tonight, I thought to myself, man, I'd love it if my roommate had an existential crisis while I'm trying to get some sleep. Really? No. Now shut up and go to bed. Some of us need sleep so we can function. Oh! Um, oh. dude, you okay? No! My back! All right, you crazy animals. Who wants to play some bingo? Oh, look at 
Look at the little fluffy pupper! Oh. Hey man, how you doing? <laughs> Uh, so fluffy. <laughs> hey you, Doctor Strange weirdo. What's your problem? I didn't sign up to have my girlfriend turned into a giggling psychopath. Cool. Is this the where history of microorganisms class is, or? Sir, we got another request coming in. Well, what are you waiting for? Send him in. Yo, dude. What's the camera for? Dude, dude, don't you remember? Tonight's supposed to be the night. Dude, it is like two in the morning, man. I got an eight a.m. What the hell's the matter? With oh, no, 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 no. Oh, hey, man. Where are we going to go today? The park, or the alley, or on 5th Street with the fire hydrant that no one else gets is mine? You forgot my trump card. Hey, mm, kitty. Oh my god! Those are the desperate ones. I can tell. So, where the heck are we putting in this password? Well, the sketch computer has this special algorithm that allows the hard drive to read the backup files, then it allows it to read, like, the deleted. It, it, in English block. Just shut up and, like, put in the password. <sighs> Whatever. Deal. 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 All right. Okay. okay. Yeah, I'll go. Yeah, you go. I'm to make a run for it. I don't know how. Open the door. I don't know. I don't know. Run. We gotta go. Go. Screw this crap, we're up! Hey, get back here! <laughs> <laughs> Sucks, but something we all have to do. It's not the only thing we all have to do around here. Hey. Okay. If you make it that kind of a joke, I'm gonna make sure the rest of this documentation ends up beside the cold. Jeez, take a joke, man. Sorry, but we gotta go. <laughs> I hope you survive your apocalypse. Oh no! Here comes that tsunami! Hey. Hey. Why don't you put those papers down and pick up this drink? Ugh, I'm sorry. I just finished a big gulp. I filled it with chilled hot chocolate. Oh, but shh. It's my cheat day. But, oh, um, but go fill these out, and then we'll really get down to business. Okay. Yeah, sure, sure thing. Alright. You got the goods? Damn right I got the goods. Oh, mystical fortune cookie. What wisdom do you have for me? Please tell me the answer. Stop wasting time. <laughs> oh no, it's Dr. Deadline. He's making everyone more stressed than they already were. I've got to stop him. Hold on, Sally. It's time for a study break. What is this? Is this some kind of joke? Good, you're awake. Ah! Ah! What? You're immune? But how? 
That's my secret, Doc. I'm always stressed. <laughs> this is great, bro. Right? Oh, yeah, bro. Right? <laughs> what? What the hell is this? It's what you asked for. No, I gave you $100 to go out and find an actual antique Ouija board. And you come back with, what, this crap? This is a Ouija ghost board. Oh, wow. Well, uh... I guess you can sleep on my floor while you're here. Gracious and humble host, the pleasure is mine. What could he be hiding? What could he be hiding? <sighs> That's just the question, isn't it? What is what? Morning. Another day and another dollar, am I right? Yeah, I hear that. I wish yesterday didn't take so much out of me, though. I know it'll cheer you up. A nice hot cup of coffee. You know, that might just do the trick. Definitely a cop. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, excuse me. I'm a bit tied up at the moment. This is intense. What are they talking about? Uh, Bones is probably telling Gravedigger not to kill you. Oh, no crap. That that's awesome. Do you know what time it is? <laughs> I can't believe you're letting him break into your own house. I let out the easiest possible heist. We don't even break into houses. He just needs to not break anything. Crap. Another day, another student saved. That was some good work today. The way you punched that guy into a tree was really impressive. Really? Yeah, it kind of reminded me of my last partner. Now, all you wrote here in all caps is Meme Lord. Care to explain? I specialize in dank memes. I can meme all day and all night. I know my memes inside and out. Something of like a meme history buff. I know my meme origins. Edgy, philosophical, political, doesn't matter. I know my memes. Still coming to IUP and getting an education. Our efforts are being stopped by this man. Your mission is to take him out along with his new sidekick known solely as Extra Credit Girl. Yeah, I do! Luckily, there's Dish Be Gone. Dish Be Gone? What's that? Glad you asked. Dish Be Gone is a new app that tackles the difficult task of getting roommates to wash their damn dishes already. Sounds great. How do I sign up? Bad guys. Ugh, sucker punched. And this time, it's personal. Are you sure you can do this? I have to. Barry! No! Do it, soldier! IUP must fall! No student will be forced to survive through finals week ever again! Barry, don't do it! IUP isn't what you think it is. Getting an education is not that bad. Finals week isn't the end of the world, but ending the Wi-Fi? That will be the end of the world. And Paul Rudd as literally every bad guy. This is crap! We gotta go find those 40 scripts. And your girlfriend. Right, right, yeah. Hey, 
You guys want to watch a movie after we take him back to jail? Yeah! yeah. Okay, you may have a point. Man, I can't wait for that Halloween party tonight. It's gonna be lit! Dude, I know! I'm so pumped. I've been working on my costume for over a month now. I'm gonna be turning heads all night tonight. Everyone's gonna wanna take a selfie with me. This is what happens when you go to IUP for 10 years. You get stuck in a tree. Ah! Don't do it! Ugh! What are you doing here? We're here to fight Dr. Deadline. Well, you better get out of here. If you don't, we're gonna have to call campus security on you. Well, we're not leaving until Dr. Deadline is back in jail. All right, you brought this on yourself. Truth is real. What? Just ask your mom. Wow. Okay. Drum roll, please! I'm not giving you a drum roll! We're gonna be late! Let's just go already! Fine! Ta-da! Well, this is a problem. Oh my god! It's Santa! Dance off? Dance off! Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. Shrieking skulls will shock your soul and seal your doom tonight. Someone should really get his read on that poor sap's blood pressure. Uh, what would you like today, Mr. Santa, sir? I like some cookies. Some cookies and, and... And a whole lot of milk. But the vending machine doesn't... Shut up! You dare question Santa Claus, the jolly old Saint Nick? My mom told me when I was younger that I needed to be really careful. I was born to be a hero, but really I just want to be myself. Hi, I'm Tommy, I'm 15 years old, and I'm really excited about playing ping pong in the Olympics. I've wanted to do this since it was my parents' dream since I was six years old. It's a dream come true. Take it. Error. The seat you're looking for cannot be found. Yeah, uh, I don't know what to tell you, buddy. Three strikes and you're out. They're, they're going. They're walking and dancing and America already has a medal. I, I didn't know we did a medal ceremony yet. Uh, they're, they're, off they go. Where were you on the night of June 23rd, 2002? Two, have you seen any suspicious activity around here lately? And three, what did you have for lunch 11 days ago? Um, I was probably in kindergarten. No, I haven't. And it's none of your business what I eat. Actually, I don't even remember. I don't keep track of that kind of stuff. Man, I believe this is against the rules, but I, then again, I have no idea what is going on in this game. Truly a great display of sportsmanship and nationality and uh, books. Education, commerce. I'll be right back. What the heck just happened? There are going to be your guidance. Since you're making college out to be like the apocalypse, I figured I'd give you the four horsemen at the very least. Stop! Stop, 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 stop! Pens and Jello. Oh boy. Darius, we're in the middle of a meeting. Well, I'm in the middle of an interview. Well, what time did the interview start? 6.15. Our meeting started at 6. Dang it, I have to go. I got a bad case of the munchies, brah. Oh, hungry. I got you, bruh. 
In a nutshell, so. So I thought to myself a little bit of sugar should do the trick. So I picked myself up, walked over to your establishment, and waltzed in here in the hopes of negotiating for the sale of some sugary goods. What? I'd like to buy some candy. Giant cat eating purple banana muffins on a tank. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna take me like a decade to pay off all these student loans. Hey, uh, narrator guy. Uh, where are your guys? I'm kind of all alone here. Sorry, sorry. He's just being a little difficult about being here. You know, senioritis is a real condition, and I would appreciate it if you didn't minimize the way it affects people. I mean, relatable. Have you got any? Expecting the answer to be no. I'll have a look for you, sir. Not much of a candy shop, is it? <laughs> wait, wait, so when do we graduate? I don't know. Five, ten, twenty-four. Not soon enough. Mm. Yeah, yeah, we have lollipops. Excellent, I'll take one then. Uh, they're very sticky, sir. Oh, no, guy, don't worry, I like them sticky. They're very sticky, sir. Bring it on, bring it on, I can handle it. Um, I think they're stickier than you'd like, sir. Look, I'm sorry I overreacted. That was just the first class I'd ever failed, and it hurt to know that you didn't tell me about the printer. <sighs> I'm sorry for not telling you about the printer. I'm also sorry for being stubborn about the IUP super security force thing. No, you did have a point there. You can't just let IUP do whatever they want. They keep letting super villains escape all the time. We have to talk about how to deal with them. Friends? Friends. So, uh, <laughs> we can just hug this out and forget about it, right? Nah, man. You're still going to jail. <sighs> so, uh, to everybody who's leaving Sketch, it was great knowing you. Wish you the best in your future. Uh, Nicola, pretty cool. Do keep doing what you're doing. And Becca, you too. And um, just want to say thanks for all the memories, and all the good times, and I learned a lot from Ashlyn and Kendall. And uh, that's about it. smoking herb and drinking burning liquor. Never rich, so we were out to make that steady figure Once I was 11 years old, my daddy told me Go get yourself a wife or you'll be lonely Once I was 11 years old Always had that dream like my daddy before me So I started writing songs, I started writing stories Something about that glory just always seemed to bore me Cause only those I really love will ever really know me Once I was 20 years old, my story got told Before the morning sun when life was lonely Once I was 20 years old See my goals, I don't believe in failure Cause I know the smallest voices, they can make it major I got my boys with me, at least 